In Buddhism, symbolic offerings are made to the Triple Gem, giving rise to contemplative gratitude and inspiration. Typical material offerings involve simple objects such as a lit candle or oil lamp, burning incense, flowers, food, fruit, water or drinks. Within the traditional Buddhist framework of karma and rebirth, offerings lead to the accumulation of merit, which leads to a better rebirth in the cycle of birth and death, Pali, Vatagamini Kusala. Progress towards release from suffering Pali, Kusala. these offerings often act as preparation for meditation. <laughs> Theravada practices Material offerings nurture generosity Pali, Dana, and virtue Pali, Sila. The act further honors the triple gem, the Buddha, Dhamma, and Sangha, deepening one's commitment to the Buddha's path. For instance, traditional chants in English and Pali, when offering lit candles, Padipa Puja, and incense, Saganda Puja, to an image of the Buddha are. Similarly, a traditional Pali incense lighting verse speaks of the Buddha's fragrant body and fragrant face, fragrant with infinite virtues. By contemplating on an offering, one tangibly sees life's impermanence. Pali, anicca, one of the three characteristics of all things upon which the Buddha encouraged his disciplines to recollect. For instance, the end of a traditional chant in English and Pali when offering flowers puffa puja to an image of the Buddha is <laughs> Mahayana practices Mahayana material offerings might be imbued with the following symbology the lighting of a candle or an oil lamp represents the light of wisdom illuminating the darkness of ignorance. The burning of incense represents the fragrant scent of morality. Flowers represents the aspiration to achieve the body of the Buddha with the 32 marks of the Buddha as well as the teaching of impermanence. Alternately, a Zen verse expresses the desire for the minds flowers to bloom in the springtime of enlightenment food fruit water drinks represents the nectar of dharma and the wish to achieve it in northern buddhism sacred images have set before them water representing hospitality to wash the face and feet scarves tib Khab tags, offering friendship Flowers, incense, lamps, perfume and food representing ones devoting all their senses to their spiritual practice. Non-material offerings In some traditions, two different types of offerings are identified. Material or hospitality offerings, Pali, Amisa Puja or Sakara Puja. Practice offerings, Pali, Patipati Puja. In this context, material offerings are considered external offerings of words and deeds. Practice offerings may be manifested by practicing giving Pali, Dana, moral conduct Sila, meditation Samadhi, wisdom Panya. in the Pali canon, the Buddha declared practice offerings as the best way of honoring the Buddha, and as the supreme offering. This is primarily an internal offering for mental development Pali, Sita, Bhavana and Samadhi. See also Almsgiving Buddhism
chanting buddhism meditation buddhism dana buddhism householder buddhism fan tray prostration buddhism puja buddhism buddhanasati recollection buddhism buddha's hand topic notes Topic Bibliography Harvey, Peter 1990. An Introduction to Buddhism, Teachings, History and Practices. Cambridge, Cambridge University. ISBN 0-521-31333-3. Indaratana Maha Thera, Elgirye Vandana, The Album of Pali Devotional Chanting and Hymns. Penang, Malaysia, Mahindarama Dhamma Publication. Retrieved of October 2007 from Budanet at http colon slash slash net slash pdf underscore file slash vandana o two dot pdf. Karyawasam, A G S nineteen ninety five Buddhist Ceremonies and Rituals of Sri Lanka The Wheel Publication No. 402-404. Kandy, Sri Lanka, Buddhist Publication Society. Retrieved 23 October 2007 from Access to Insight 1996 transcription at http colon slash slash www.accestoinsight.org slash lib slash authors slash karyawasam slash wheel 402.html hash ch3 Kaplow, Philip 1989b Zen, Merging of East and West. NY, Anchor Book. ISBN 0-385-26104-7. Kantipalo, Bhikkhu Lay Buddhist Practice, The Shrine Room, Aposatha Day, Reigns Residence The Wheel No. 206-207. Kandy, Sri Lanka, Buddhist Publication Society. Retrieved of October 2007 from Access to Insight transcribed 1995 at http colon slash 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 authors slash candipalo slash wheel 206.html Lee Damodaro, Ajahn and Thanissaro Bhikkhu, trans. 1998. Visaka Puja. Retrieved the 22nd of October 2007 from Access to Insight at http colon slash slash www.accestoinsight.org slash lib slash tie slash lee slash visaka dot html. Nyanaponika Thera 2000. The Vision of Dhamma, Buddhist Writings of Nyanaponika Thera. Seattle, BPS Pariyati Editions. ISBN 1-928706-03-7. Sony, R. L. and Bhikkhu Kantipalo 2006. Life's Highest Blessings, The Maha Mangala Sutta. Retrieved the 22nd of October 2007 from Access to Insight at http colon slash slash www.accestoinsight.org slash lib slash authors slash sony slash wheel 254.htm Topic External Links About the Buddha Altar Soto Zen Home Altar with Offerings. The Consecration Ritual Virtual Puja at Emerald Buddha Temple Wadfrey Q